Thanks for joining Living on the Cheap and trying to figure it out. Today we're talking about furniture. So what happened was when we first got married, we were pretty dead broke. I was in full-time uh, university. My husband was working part-time and that's what happens when you get married at 19 and 20. Or was it 2021? Anyways, I can't remember. It's been so bloody long. But anyhow, um, we got all our furniture secondhand. Uh, we had uh, renters, uh, my father and, between my father and Dave's father, they had rental properties and they all had um, people who would move and leave furniture behind. I don't know why people do this. So like we got our kitchen set, we got our living room, uh, like the coffee table, the end tables, uh, the TV stand, all that kind of stuff we got used and for free. Unfortunately, because it was already old when we got it, um, it only lasted about 10 years and we had to buy new furniture. So I'm going to show you what I have in my living room because I got some new furniture this last week and uh, go from there. So after our first 10 years, we ended up buying this couch. It's actually a two piece. Uh, they advertised it as a sectional, but it was what it was supposed to do was be have a lounger, like one side a left one and the lounger on the right, but they kept screwing it up for whoever had ordered it. So we got this at half off because it was a left and a right without the lounger at all. So you can separate it. We always keep it together as one long couch because it just makes more sense that way than having two separate love seats. We had it for over 10 years. And then just this past weekend, we acquired, well, that's our TV stand that we bought probably about 10 years ago as well because a lot of our furniture went. That's from Ikea. And then we got this coffee table, which has um, drawers on either end. Again, at Ikea, we like Ikea. They're very cheap. But we got this chair. I don't know if you can see it really well with the light coming through. From my aunt. And we also got... Oh, we bought that chair on Craigslist for $30. And then we got this couch this weekend as well. It matches the first chair. It is gorgeous. We love it. Even though it's old... Um, the cushion, the whole chairs have been, both chairs, or chairs, the sofa and the chair have been reupholstered. And my aunt picked the densest possible cushioning to get redone. I don't know if the furniture was new when she got it or if she bought it used. But the cushions were so dense that my cousins would tell me <coughs> it was the most uncomfortable chair couches to sit on. And now it is perfect. They're still fairly dense. They haven't lost any shape at all, as you can see. And we're loving it because now with all our parents aging, we have a lot more seating room for everybody when we have family dinners. Please excuse my mess. We do live in this house, so there's stuff everywhere. But yeah, just wanted to share that with you all today. Um, my poor aunt, she actually, the reason I'm getting her furniture is because she moved from her house to um, senior living. And there is no room for, there is a love seat that actually matches this set. I'm going to try to zoom closer on this one. Um, and she kept the love seat because that fits in her room with her bed. And that's it. Not even room for a coffee table or anything. And so that's how I ended up getting the furniture. Yay! Gotta love aunts and uncles. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you soon.